Hey, welcome back everyone. So we are back in the seat of the Matriarch Dungeon. Now, we left off in the last episode where we accidentally fell off the ledge. Now those enemies are pretty damn difficult. Not, and I'm kind of wondering if we should be there. Because I actually uh, continued a bit. I was recording, well at least I thought I was recording. And I continued a bit on and uh, yeah. I died again. <laughs> and uh, I need to go pick up my coin. So you'll see where I died once I pick up my coin. I'm just wondering if if this is really the way to go or if I'm missing another path somewhere. But we're gonna press on and uh, yeah, just keep getting, uh, keep moving forward. Trusting that it is the way that we need to go. Do not die. Please do not die. Oh, come on. Jaquel died again. What a surprise that is. He's just an imbecile. He really is. Alright, so... I just want to see if there's any other loot or anything of the kind. But it doesn't seem like there is. I think I picked up everything. Or well, at least most of it. Man, it pisses me off that he falls off the ledges every time. Yeah, dodge straight into that. <laughs> there we go. I feel so under level. Maybe I am. If I am, wait, well, at least it adds a little bit more difficulty. <laughs> But I really do feel under leveled. So it's either I'm under leveled, or my weapons are under leveled at least, or I'm heading in the wrong direction. I really don't feel like I am heading in the wrong direction. Hey, what's that? Oh, this that's where we need to go, by the way. We can actually just take a shortcut, but screw it. Whoa, what? Okay. How was that a dodge? But I'll take it. That, that just never gets old, does it? Man, I was really hoping that would have killed him. I haven't used the two-handed in quite some time. And okay, we need these potions. Is there any way 
to summon uh, your your partner again. Amora, are you gonna help me out? Please. That's almost like a beacon, isn't it? See? But now look at this. I think I just realized something. Once I hold that in, it just doesn't do anything. It's more like a come help me kind of, or come to me. But once I select this, now I hold it in. It shows me into, it, it actually points in a, in a direction. Now, if we look at this, see, this is what makes me doubt myself now. That's going in that direction. If I hold this in, now it's showing, no, screw it, man. I don't even care. Whatever. Every time I move, it shows a different direction. Okay, well, that's the same, to be fair. Still the same. Shit, okay. Kind of not working out for me right now. Oh, there's missiles! I thought I hated these guys. I actually, I'm fine with them. It's these giants that I hate. Now let's see again. Now it's showing that direction. How does that make any sense? Anyway, we're over it. Just basically gonna close our eyes and keep moving forward. And this is where it gets difficult. But this is where I could seriously use a partner. See? Still pointing in that direction though. Kill, I need you. Please come help. Oopsie, didn't mean to do that. Okay, it is a quest marker. But nonetheless, it's still very confusing. I think it's pointing to down there. No, 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 it's not. These guys. They are a pain in the ass. Hey, that wasn't too bad. I think that's the best I've ever done against one of them. Or we're not gonna grab any potions right now. All right, I think we can see. Uh, no, we can't. But our, our coin is yeah there. That's where we died. Man, I was not too happy about that. But, you know, that's part of the life. That's part of the game.
Oh my... You saw that, right? I almost just died again. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I saw a third one. Didn't I? Or am I hallucinating? What the hell? I, I'm so sure I saw another one. Yeah, it fell down though. What the? You okay there, buddy? Did I just hear another one? I did. Oh! Where did you come from exactly? What? Hello? Man, I wish I had spears. I would have thrown it at, at, at that dude. Oh, there's another one down there. Just keeps on getting better, doesn't it? I think I want to use that and that. See how this goes for us. Oh, I don't like the... Well, I mean, I like the effect, but not in battle, man. Kind of distracting, isn't it? Okay, well, he's dead. Oh, there's one more little asshole down here. No, don't get let him get a hit in. Got our coin back. Mmm, look at all that coin, dude. What? Alright. Oh, wait a minute. Um, shit. Ah, oh, this is gonna suck. Let's just do it. Where is our friend? Does he only come back once we get to a ritual stone? That would really suck, because I don't even know where the next one is. I haven't even seen, you know, that beacon light that shines up in the sky. I haven't seen that, I haven't seen the stone, I haven't seen anything. Nada. Nothing. Okay, let's grab our potions. And then head straight back in. And hope not to die. I think if we feel like we're gonna die, we just need to leave. Because we've got 61,000 score here. We don't want to lose that. We can use that to upgrade our weapon. And uh, that would obviously make things down here a lot easier. Having a stronger weapon. Oh, what was that? Oh, that was the stamina bar running out. I actually kind of like that, that it runs out, but at then again, you would know that it ran out, right? There we go. How did those two kill me the last time? What? It's those purple 
creature things, man. They're so unpredictable, and sometimes they just do a ton of damage. What the what? <laughs> what the what? What the what? What what was that? It's just stand still. Oh, thought I heard footsteps. Oh. I'm not taking any chances. I want to stay full health. Thought I saw something next to me. I forgot you can put it down. Oh yeah, I'm not confident about this. Yes! Our savior! Your kill! Your kill! You're an idiot, Jerko. Jeez, man. I'm sorry, I'm blaming him, but in the first place, I shouldn't have gotten hit. And he's using a heavy weapon, and that's kind of holding him back. How big is this place? It's ridiculous. Risky. Very risky. Oh, sapient moss. Are you kidding me? Are you nuts, Jokel? Do you want me to die? Oh, hi. Come on down and play. No? Oh no. Don't die, Jokel, please. Here we go. This seems to be the way, but before we head this way... What's down this way? Man, it feels good making progress, doesn't it? Damn. What's that noise? I see you, and I heard you. Come on down. Come on. Really? Watch him drop down as soon as we walk past. It's scary, man, because enemies can hide anywhere. What kind of trick was that? Dude did a quick handstand before attacking. <laughs> yeah, give me more uh, mushrooms. I have no idea if I'm going in the right direction, but I'm... I have a feeling we are. Let's just call it a gut feeling, right? Wow, what a reward. <gasps> oh.
Okay, well, we can climb down there. But I'm not going to do that. Clearly not. Just doesn't seem like the smart move. I saw you. There's something up there. And this was the other way around, right? Yeah, 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 okay. Alright, let's let's head back down. And uh, go down these stairs. See where that takes us. This place is so big. I know I've said it a thousand times. Oh, <laughs> yes. That feels good. And of course, we cannot travel here because there's no <laughs> there's no creature to pick us up. What's this? Why is it targeting me? What? Well, not targeting, but it's like following my every move. Kind of like magnetizing to me, if that's even magnetize. That's a word, right? Yeah, I'm a bit worried about this place. Webs? Oh joy. My favorite. Yeah, I don't think we're gonna find anything out here. There might probably be something, but... Eh, I'm not gonna be running around in the dark for minutes and hours and... Nah. Just doing it quick um, check maybe there is something like a very quick uh, light little check and if we don't see anything then we just head on if this was me playing single player like with all the time in the world I would have checked every nook and cranny man there's a light over there in that corner but it's one of those statues by the way, getting back to the statues, there's so many of them now, I don't think uh, you can really do anything with them. Alright, I want to check out this corner though. There wouldn't be a statue here for no reason, would there? I guess there would. Or could. Uh, yeah. That's way too dark. Let's get, let's get back. <laughs> let's just get back. And let's not stray from the path, right? Sound like a good idea? Okay, great. Glad we're on the same page. Oh, he just summoned something. He's handstanding again. Are you? Yeah, he's fine. When he wants to, he can really carry his own weight. And then other times, it's just like, nope. He wants to die. You can see it in his eyes, even though he doesn't have any. Man, I gotta say, the difficulty really picked up uh, once we hit these caves. These specific caves. The others were fine. Didn't really have any problem with the others. It really picked up here. And that's why I kind of like 
the specter I was going in the wrong direction, going to the wrong place. Oh. Nice moves. Oh no, that hit me. What was that noise? Oh, it's like a mini Garron. What? Okay. Interesting. Come on, boys. It looks like we might be close to the end of this cave journey. Could this be the boss fight ahead? We're about to find out. That noise makes me think of a murloc in World of Warcraft. Oh well, War Warcraft. Oh, this has got to be it. Here we go. I see someone. This is for sure a boss fight. Alright, no words. Just fighting. Excuse me, look at that hell. What's this about? What? No, 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 no. I think we destroyed it. What the? She's not taking damage. She is best off, man. Now she's really taking more damage. Get out, get out, get out. Your kill. Nice heal. Let's not take any chances. Oh. We did it. No, 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 no. Marin defeated. Hell yeah. Whew. Got a little dicey there in the end. Runic Bulwark. Geffen's Blessing. It's still sad though. Like, it's Garuron's sister, right? Still very sad. Been corrupted? 
Like, am I understanding that correctly? He was corrupted? It's, I think it says that, right? Should Amarin choose to defend the listener heart? Yeah, she stole the heart and that corrupted her. Now this is the listener woman. Whoever she is. I, I'm guessing we're going to find out right now. That was a cool fight though. Really cool fight. I am Sillerin, sister to this matriarch, yet neither friend nor ally. I knew this day would come for Amiren. Heartless as it sounds, I wish it had come sooner. I kind of understand that. Is that the cunning pestle you carry? You must have met Tuma and Suma already. Good. Then I can make use of it, and you too shall benefit from its curious power. I'm sorry, what? Tuma and Suma? I don't remember someone like that. Have you heard of the Shadow Pathways? They can be used to travel short distances. Glowing hearts within human husks threaded together through devoted sacrifice. Now that I am free, I can travel these pathways and I can help you do the same. Bring the cunning pestle to me in Vagrant's Rest. It is a safer place for such delicate work. Now, would you like to see the fast way out? Uh, yeah, I don't see anything else for us down here, so yeah. Now I'm guessing what she spoke of was like, boss traveling for dungeons? Whoa. Really? You're continuing your work? Damn. Okay. Alright, so before we upgrade our weapon, I just want to see what she makes available to us. And while we're here... Okay, sure, take a sip. Let's just put some stuff away. We're not going to be using that or that. Hmm, we haven't upgraded this one too much. So maybe, maybe we should be done with that. I'm not going to be using that. Nor that. Let's just check something first. I'm not going to upgrade it just yet, but I just want to have a quick look. Bateron, I will be with you shortly. See, this does 85. Oh, look at that, though. Oh, but the crit chance. How much does it cost? 4,500? And then 9,000. Okay, that's enough for now. Because, like I said, I first want to see what she has available for us. Let's just have a quick look at this thing. Okay. Yeah, that looks cool. Yeah, I like that. Now, where is she? Up here? Ah, oh, here she is. Okay. I hope the twins didn't give you too much trouble. Now give me the cunning pestle, so I may open the world of shadow for you. Am I missing Tuma and Ruma somewhere? Where? When did we meet them? Feel the restful darkness flow through your veins. Now you may travel the pathways of shadow. Before you go, Come to my brewing stand. There are some recipes I might concoct for you, should you bring me the right ingredients. Leech draw? 
and Sturm spirits. Oh man, we've got we've only got one fire kelp, but I I think we can buy one. More damage and damage resistance. Wait, minus damage resistance. You deal more damage, but your damage resist. Yeah, hmm. Not really about that life. Completely heals you over time, but using another healing item damages you. Okay, that adds like a little interesting spin to it. All right, so I think we should at least upgrade our main weapon. Okay, that's that's a good upgrade. Doing a lot more damage now, 106. And then heavy hit is 141. Oh yeah, swing that sword. Damn, we still got a hell of a lot of points. I think we skipped something, man. Or I'm just completely forgetting, um, forgetting the twins. I have not told Bartaram this, but Amiren's prison was as subtle as it was cruel. She smothered me in wards that blinded my eyes and dulled my nose and fingers. I need my senses restored if I am to brew potions with any degree of prowess. To regain my full sight, I need Riox Talon. Of all the Elder Dark, he saw the deepest. My sister sometimes mentioned the Talon during her mad mutterings. The Twisted Canyon. That's where she said it fell long ago. I hope it's still there. Talon of Riok. Okay, we'll definitely go check that out. For a second, I thought she meant this one's mother. Uh, this baby's mother, but... I guess not. I don't think uh, the Diasora is um, is one of the Elder Dark. All right, Bateron, I'm sorry, man. I got bad news. I lost Amiren a long time ago. I had given up hope of regaining Silurin. Yes, Silurin has suffered at Amiren's hand. That much is terribly clear. It will be some time before she is her old self again. I will do what I can to help. Now, please, take the listener heart to Amara. She will know what to do with it. Will do, buddy. Robust crafting. That's one of the perks that you can put on the talisman, right? Where's Amara? He's usually up here. Yeah, there she is. In one breath, you have taken a sister and returned a sister. Impressive. You have the listener heart as well, I see. Give it to me so I can continue the search. The twin hearts are linked, so I should be able to follow the thread connecting them. But a knot of darkness prevents it. Somewhere between the hillside and the Featherlands. I cannot cut through the shadows that lie behind the hillside. It is a knot so tangled, so intricate. It might as well be Cisna's own web. My people shunned Cisna's work, the spinning of deceits and shadows. Instead, we watched from afar, unraveling her dark ways with eye and mind. Our observations were inscribed on tablets and locked away within the halls of Cliffa. To pierce Cisna's tangle, we must venture to those fallen halls and find the archive tablet. 
Okay. Sounds like we've got a lot of work more to do. We got a lot of points, man. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Before we upgrade our potion, I just want to have a quick look at this. We've got a new relic. Stage 1, damage resistance. Stage 2, damage resistance. Stage 3, damage resistance is 100%. Oh, and it lasts for 23 seconds. The damage resistance to a single hit builds up over time. Maybe we should move on. Let's equip this one. What do we look like? Okay, okay, okay. And then what do we have new? Your damage... Uh, yeah, okay, no, we don't like that. Damage, you temporarily deal bonus damage after killing an enemy. Well, yeah, of course we're going to take that. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's that's right. We need to unequip first. Your health? Yeah, let's take that off. Then we put on Rampage, obviously. You deal bonus damage if your companion dies until you rest at a ritual stone. Stamina penalties. Your armor stamina penalties are reduced by 25%. That's good. Print stamina cost. Yeah, that's that's just like a um, convenience thing. Let's put that on. Oh, well, gonna mean to do that. Ooh, yeah. We can do way more damage now. Or more hits. Wait, what? When did that change? Oh, I think it changes according to the... Um, the uh, relic... Oh, not relics, but the, like... Yeah, relics, right? The relics you put on as well. Not just the talisman. Oh, maximum upgrade. Okay. Now this looks sick, man. I like that. Alright, and then finally, what else do we want to do? We want to upgrade our potion strength, right? That's an important thing to do as well. Okay, this was uh, pretty good. In the last episode, we finished one of Elia's, Elia's uh, kills. Very nice. That is extremely good. Yeah, we killed one of uh, the, what's his name, Ake? And then in this episode, we killed Amirin, which was an awesome fight. Alright guys, I think I'm going to call it here. If you enjoyed this episode, please remember to leave a like and subscribe. And I hope you have a great night.